We're on with Jason. Jason, uh, we're finally in 2021, uh, early January. And obviously, we just got done with 2020. An interesting year. Would you like to put it in your own words, the perspective of 2020? Wasn't that bad. Wasn't bad. It really, it really wasn't that bad. Um, I, like, I stay at home anyway. I, summer of 2019 and summer of 2020 really wasn't all that different. There was the same amount of differences there were from summer of 2018 and 2019 there were from 2019 to 2020. Really, there wasn't a lot of change. Um, in the year, the most change came from school, um, which I'll get in, whatever. But aside from school and everything else, I did what I was going to do anyway, just stay indoors, just do what I'm going to do. It, it really didn't affect me. Um, obviously, going out and that kind of stuff affected me. But aside from what I was already going to do. So, you know, in being short term with it, it affected other people probably way more dramatically yeah, than you, yeah. for sure. Of course. And obviously, someone like myself is working from home as opposed to going into the building. But you're also, that's what you mean about the school part. Yeah, that was different for you. Obviously, I don't like it. I prefer to be in school with friends and, and socialize more. Um, when you're doing this online, it's just, here's work, do it. Um, but I, I've gotten used to it. It's more of a, I'm content with it. I would prefer if there was something better, but I much preferred this than to the half and half method of just going in for two days, staying home on Wednesday, and Thursday, Friday, where other kids go in, and you're doing the same computer work if you're going in, and if you're not, you're going to be separated anyway. So I much prefer this, where it's just get up, do the work, and that's it. And it's annoying, but not annoying enough for me to be. It's just it's fine. That's 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 what the like I said. It's it could be better. But, and it, things could always be better. Now, 2020, can you name the most interesting or fun thing that happened to you in the last year? Oh. Was uh, the most fun? No, interesting. <laughs> oh, interesting. I did, yes, I did say Obviously interesting. Obviously, <laughs> interesting. I even knew from like the first week, I'm like, this is going to be weird. It was just extended weird. Um, it's, it was, I mean, it, honestly, it felt like the year started in March. It, 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 to me, it feels like January and February were just add-ons to 2019. Um, yeah. And the year started in March. Um, but, yeah, obviously, the, the, the masks um, and just, again, I, I stay home a lot, but I obviously stayed home more than I would have anyway. Um, again, it's not enough, like school, it's just not enough to, like, be like, it's just more of a contentment, um, but yeah, it's, uh, just the, the, it's, it's really just COVID, I mean, that's, it's, um, just not being, like, again, I, I don't use the option, like, again, I stay home a lot, but I don't use the option to go outside, a lot, but now that I just don't have the option, it just feels more weird to do what I'm gonna do anyway, which is stay inside. It's like, it's it's weird because when you don't pay attention to a thing, but then when it's taken away, it, it's like, it's like imagine you, know, you got a TV in a room, you don't use the TV, you know, it's always there. But then once the TV's gone. It's like, I mean, I wasn't going to use it anyways, <laughs> but now that it's gone, I just feel weird without it. That's how I would describe it. All right, makes sense. Um, do you feel like 2021 will be sort of similar, or do you think there will be some major changes and, like, maybe in, in the fall of 2021, you'll be back in school normally? I don't and, know. And, well, have you been wearing masks anywhere? Are you used to wearing yes. a mask? Uh, yeah. 
All right. Um, doctor appointments, so on and so forth? I, I haven't gone to the doctor's in months, but just, when I just, yeah, the few, when, I, when I go to a store, which is very rare, like to a haircut, which I haven't because it's so short now, um, yeah, um, I went to the, uh, to get new, like, frames, right. um, so that's, that was the last time I wore a mask. Any um, final thoughts? Oh, well, I want to talk about the 2021 thing. Go ahead. I really don't, because, like, in 2019, people said, fresh start of the decade, this is going to be great, this is going to be a new year, mm -hmm. it's going to be, this is going to be the year, we're going to start things off great. Gonna do it's gonna be great, and that didn't happen. And now the same thing's happening. Where everyone's saying 2021, it's gonna be this rebuilding year. It's gonna be great. It's gonna be, you know, this this is gonna we're finally, you know, we can put 2020 behind and move forward. That's what people said about 2020. And, and like I, I thought, okay, maybe a month when they first did the quarantine, and now it's been nine months. So, for all I know, we could be still in quarantine in 2022, but Angela, vaccine, so that could probably help, but I, I don't know. All right. Thank you, Jason. Yes. Um, but like I said, um, wasn't that bad for me, really, is the main thing. It's for me. Could be better, but I'm content. Okay.